we felt 30% of the blast and the other 70% was absorbed by the sea. I was driving from my village to Beirut when I felt it from miles away. We now know that the blast was 120th the power of an anatomic bomb. It has thrust Lebanon into its worst economic crisis in decades. Many families lost their loved ones and their homes, but the youth of Lebanon were the first to rush into the streets to help bring our country back to life. In 2020, the COVID-19 pandemic came to Lebanon to support our people. I founded Café Bekafak, meaning hand in hand, with five co-founders. I believe every person has the right to live in dignity. That's our mission. Following the blast, Café Bekafak was already in place to provide our help and were on the scene the very next day. Through crowdfunding, we've since raised money to rehabilitate 13 homes and reach thousands of families all over Lebanon. We started out asking our family members to spread the word but technology is all around us and we use it to amplify our work and to connect with our community. Our organization is building an international community of young leaders and innovators and shedding light on the human needs all over the globe. That's why I will continue to fight for a better future. Raising my voice, not just for the people of Lebanon, but for citizens around the world.